Today we're going to be using a microscope to look at leaves under, well, under the microscope. Um, if you want to know more about the microscope, just say something in the comments and I'll make a video on the microscope. But I'm going to be doing stuff on plants today, on the plant leaves. Let's get started. We have this leaf, um, and this is part of a, an, like an invasive bush that grew kind of close to the house so we cut it down multiple times it keeps going back so let's see what it looks like under a microscope okay two in the microscope here's the leaf it's hard to film with the camera on my phone but yeah let me move it around a little so here's the stem you can see there's a little bit of debris over in the corner um, yeah, it's pretty, it's, there's a lot of fibers on the, on the leaf. Alright, here's leaf two, this is part of a dandelion leaf. So here's the, here's the second sample. <coughs> oh, you can see the stem over there in the corner. Um, there's like a hair on the screen, or on the leaf, a little bit of debris, I guess. Uh, yeah, there's not a lot going on here. There's a lot of, these, all these little white, like, strands, those are veins for the leaf to, like, deliver nutrients and stuff. Um, yeah, and then there's, you can slightly see it, there's a little bit of an orange spot. That's what we're starting to rat. Um. <clears throat> so, yeah. This one also came off of a weed. Um. I don't know which one, though. I know this one's got a bunch of weird colors on it, so this one should look cool under the microscope. And, sure enough, it does look pretty cool under the microscope. You can see there's a lot of debris on this leaf. Ooh. And even some rot. It's standing the rot over here in the corner. You can see little insects. I mean, this leaf is just crazy. Look, those are all. Oh no, those are seeds. Yeah, this leaf is pretty beat up. <laughs> be interesting it was off of like a plant with like a reed so let's look at this now yeah this one's pretty simple it's just a bunch of reeds in a straight line there's nothing really interesting about this one I mean you can see all the fibers but that's about it that's the only thing kind of cool this one's off of a hosta um, it's kind of like a like two colors at once so this one should be cool so the weird thing is under a microscope you can see the white the white parts of vein by the way. But you can see otherwise where the green in the light green meat and it's not as pronounced as you'd think it would be. Like it's a lot more subtle up close under the microscope. And then there's more debris of course. So here we have a little piece of magazine under the microscope. You can see all the little dots where they mix the color together. Pretty cool. Oh yeah, I'm get in focus again. Yeah. So they've got purple, red, yellow, and blue. It's kind of cool. You can see all the dots underneath the microscope. Here's what black looks like under a microscope. It's pretty cool, right? It's not completely black, although it... It almost is. You can see a little bit of blue and red on it, and then the white background, of course. This is what the edge of, of a piece of paper looks like. That's why it gives you a paper cut, because it's kind of sharp on the edge. It's not as smooth as you'd think it was. So here's what pen looks like under the microscope. Again, not as straight as you'd think it would be. And you can even see all the texture in the paper and ink. Pretty, pretty neat. 
it's also a black pen and it almost looks purple purple here and this might be, be because I'm using a note card but it might also be because the ink is slightly dark or is dark purple instead of black like I thought it was here's a marker it's a little bit more straight but you can still see all the lines but not least pencil lead this one definitely has a lot of marks in it it's <clears throat> it's by by far the least fine type of writing tool I mean it's just a regular pencil it's no specific softness or hardness these are just like Ticonderoga ones that you'd buy for, us, for school supplies yeah, that concludes our video. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.